Hello guys, this video is about if you were using kids mode on a Samsung device and then you forgot the pin number or, and, uh, and or the backup password I uh, pretty much stuck in kids mode because it's a protection for the that way the kids don't go into the device and um, so I'm going to show you, I'm going to guide you actually um, how to get out of kids mode and uh, another problem I ran into was um, since it was stuck on kids mode the not notifications menu that you usually are just able to like drop down from the top of the screen by pressing your finger on top of the screen that wasn't working either as a result of the the tablet being locked in kids mode so that's the secondary problem but let me show you first how to get out of kids mode uh, this is usually what it looks like something like this the crocodile and like that so so the first thing what you're gonna have to do is uninstall kids mode and to do that you have to restart the device but you have to restart it in safe mode so the way you do that is just uh, hold down the power button until it gives you, gives you the options to, to either power off or you know airplane mode or, or going to restart so just select restart then while it's restarting hold down the volume down button uh, until it gets to the home screen so hold down the volume down button until it gets to the home screen and that'll uh, that'll put the device into safe mode and once again we're talking about Samsung devices that use Android operating system and the reason I have this up is because that's a tablet we have at home and that's a tablet I had the problem with it's the Galaxy Samsung Galaxy Tab Pro 8.4 inch tablet and I don't have it here with me so I'm using uh, Google Images to pull up just to, just to show you what it looks like so once you're in safe mode you have to go look for go into where the apps are all your little apps icons and stuff and then you're going to look for the kids mode icon Let's see. which uh, should look like that like a little crocodile Let's see. kids mode icon you should be able to see it, it's labeled, I mean it says kids mode and it's got the little crocodile so once you find that icon put your finger on it and hold it down, not too hard, just regular. Hold it down, and it's gonna. So you, once you do that, you want to drag that icon to uh, the uninstall option, which should should show up on the top of the screen. Once you once you press down on the kids mode icon and hold it down, your finger on it, that little that option should appear on top of the screen. It'll say uninstall and make a couple other options so just drag it to where it says uninstall and it will uninstall it for you that's all you have to do I mean as far as, far as that goes to uninstall okay so after uh, after you do that then you have to go to the power button again hold it down and then until you, you know you see the, the little window that gives you the three options to either power off airplane mode or restart select restart and then just this time just let it start up normally once it, the device starts up again and it's back um, it's back up to normal um, what you want to do is you want to check to see if because this is a problem I had with mine with the tablet was I couldn't get the notifications menu to come down like even if kids mode was uninstalled and everything I couldn't get it to it just seemed to be like locked 
for some reason. So I could not get the not notification menu to come down at all. Yeah. And you guys are very familiar with this. This is where like if you get an email or Facebook notification or your Wi-Fi, GPS, Bluetooth, etc. You know, that's that's the notifications menu. And you, I guess you can call it also the settings menu. And it shows the time and all that. And so I couldn't get that to come down even though I uninstalled the kids mode. So what you want to do is and I believe that that's a result of the the tablet was locked in kids mode so that's why I wouldn't let the notifications notifications menu come down for some reason maybe it's like a glitch or something I'm not sure but this is how to fix it so as I mentioned we uninstalled kids mode already when we were in safe mode now we're back in regular operating mode and what you want to do is just you know go into the apps and find the kids mode um let's see here you know the icon should look should look like that a little crocodile you know it'll it'll say kids mode so I just press that okay and it's gonna open up you know the little the window and it's gonna say you need you need to install that this app and it's about I think it's about like 98 megabytes in size so go ahead and install it into your device again install it um, okay let, and then it's probably gonna take you know depending on your connection speed it might take like two to three minutes you know uh, might take a you know a couple minutes to install because it's not like I said it's 98 megabytes it's gotta download all that so once it's installed go into it and set it up it's, it's only gonna ask you like two you know, two or three questions, you know, it's going to ask you the name of the child, the birth date, if you want to put a little picture of the child, and you can select a picture from your gallery. And it's going to ask you uh, which apps do you want to be enabled in kids mode, like which apps can the kid use, you know, but just, you know, set it up and make sure this time, you know, to pick an easy you know, pin number, the personal identif identification number. Just be sure to pick an easy one to remember. I just did one, two, three, four. You know, that's the numbers I chose in that order. And then once you choose a pin, it's gonna ask you to confirm. Then it's gonna ask you to choose a backup password. So the back backup password, I also just put one, two, three, four in that order, just those numbers. It's easy to remember. And then, uh, what? Yeah, so I just finished setting up kids mode, and um, yep. Yeah. So then, uh, exit kids mode. You should be able to just exit. Um, this is like, I believe it's one of the main screens. You should be able to exit kids mode. That little door right there. That'll exit kids mode, but it'll ask you for the pin number. So in my case, I would just put one, two, three, four. That's my pin number. And then it'll let me exit out of kids mode. And then the one on the left there, it's called parental mode. Which I think lets you like edit the settings and all that. And it'll, it'll also ask you for a pin number. Which in this case it'll be again, one, two, three, four. That's the pin number that I chose for my, my tablet. So, uh, what ended up happening once I finished setting up you know, kids mode. You know, after reinstalling it and setting it up again and all that, um, the notifications menu it started working again. Like I could bring it down, and so pretty much the tablet started working in normal again. So, yep. So that's pretty much what my video is about. It's uh, first thing is to get out, to be able to get out of kids mode. Cause just rem remember what I said in the beginning. If you don't have the pin number. Or the password it's not gonna let you exit out of kids mode unless you do a restart into safe mode you know the restart it restart that device into safe mode then uninstall kids mode then restart the tablet into normal mode just regular mode and then you have to reinstall kids mode set it up 
you know, with the pin number, you have to put in your create a pin number and a backup password. And so I just finished setting up kids mode and then it should be all back to normal after that. And I did go, I, I, went, I went on Google to like look up solutions because a lot of times, you know, you can just find like solutions to like little problems if you're with your with the device that you're having. Yeah, if you're having like little problems with your device, usually people, you know, they ran into those problems before you and they posted like how do they, how they, uh, found a solution to that problem, you know. So I did that and, you know, I, I spent a few minutes looking through those and I couldn't really find, you know, how to do it until I just did it on my own. And I did also, of course, you know, gather a couple of, you know, there was this one article that showed how to restart in safe mode. So I used that information. And then, you know, I think another one said, you know, uninstall kids mode. And so I did that. And so pretty much I combined, you know, knowledge from like, or information from a couple different articles, you know, to, to fix this, uh, this problem I had, which once again, I'll say it again, probably for the third time. The problem was I couldn't get out of kids mode because I didn't have the pin number or the password, the backup password. And then the secondary problem was I couldn't get the notifications menu to come down. Even after I, I, even after I uninstalled kids mode, I couldn't get the notifications menu, which is that right there. I couldn't get that to come down. So that's why I had to go through that whole process. And I hope none of you have to go through that, but in case you run into that scenario, you know, I hope uh, I was able to help you with the directions and feel free to leave me a comment or a question and I'll try to answer it. Okay. And once again, I was using a Samsung Galaxy Tab Pro, the 8.4 inch tablet, which it looks like that. That's the one I was using. And then I was in kids mode. So leave your comment, question, and I'll try to answer them. Thank you for watching.